Envision an enormous ensemble played by an endless number of stars, planets, and moons, all performing together wonderfully. Among this celestial symphony, one specific segment has astounded space experts for quite some time. Exoplanets. Exoplanets are regular planets that exist outside our solar system, hidden deep within the Milky Way. You may be surprised to discover that among the vast number of astronomical objects, there are exoplanets so similar to Earth, so tantalizingly alike yet confounding, that they could very well be our planet's celestial twin. Let us dive into the intriguing domain of Proxima b, located just 4.2 light-years away. The James Webb Space Telescope is revolutionizing our quest to understand these divine mysteries. Envision a moment when your mind ventures across the vast cosmic domain of our galaxy, the Milky Way, home to more than a quadrillion exoplanets, a number with 15 zeros. To put this into perspective, if each of these exoplanets were the size of a grain of sand, we wouldn't just fill the Grand Canyon. We would have enough to create another landmark on Earth, a Grand Canyon 2.0 stretching an immense distance. What's most astounding is that about 20% of these heavenly bodies have been classified as Earth-like in terms of topography and atmospheric structure. This means there is a 1 in 5 chance of finding a twin to our planet. And the story doesn't end there. Alongside these planets could be another quadrillion moons, rocky satellites like our moon, engaged in a gravitational dance with their parent planets. When considering the possibility of discovering another celestial body harboring life or capable of doing so, the universe offers an abundance of opportunities. Now that we have unfolded the fabric of this immeasurable scale, it's time to introduce the expert craftsman poised to paint its intricate subtleties, the James Webb Space Telescope. This divine Sherlock Holmes, with its magnified focal lens replaced by adjustable focal points, surpasses even the most advanced optical instruments. But it's not just any lens, it's a 6.5-meter primary mirror, 2.7 times larger than Hubble's. Imagine the incredible detail it can distinguish, from the faintest flicker of a star billions of light-years away to the subtle features of orbiting planets. What makes the James Webb Telescope revolutionary is not just its observational power but also its advanced technology, including state-of-the-art sensors and spectrographs. These tools do more than observe. They analyze and filter the extraordinary light signatures emitted or reflected by celestial objects to interpret their atmospheric conditions, densities, and even masses. Acting as a cosmic scientist, it can determine whether a planet has water, organic compounds, or even oxygen. The James Webb Space Telescope has the capability to answer these profound questions, elevating it from a mere observer to a scientific virtuoso. It's not just a step forward from Hubble, it's a quantum leap. If Hubble's discoveries amazed you, prepare for a true gala of celestial revelations. As we expand our exploration across the intricate landscape of the universe, let's focus on one specific star in the celestial symphony, Proxima b. Since its discovery in 2016, this enigmatic planet has captured the attention of stargazers and researchers alike, akin to a Shakespearean hero full of intricacies and mysteries. Why all the fuss? First, Proxima b lies in our astronomical neighborhood, a mere 4.2 light-years from Earth. To put this into context, if you could travel at the speed of light, the universal speed limit, you would arrive in just over four years, roughly the same time it takes for your favorite TV show to cycle into reruns. This proximity is especially significant because the universe spans over 93 billion light-years across. Discovering a planet so close and so promising for scientific research is like finding a jewel in a pile the size of Mount Everest, a jewel that may hold secrets about life itself. In the grand tapestry of the universe, Proxima b is a multifaceted thread offering important clues that could redefine our understanding of habitability and life beyond Earth. What excites researchers most is not just its proximity but also the tantalizing signs that Proxima b is not only Earth-like but potentially Earth 2.0. This planet resides in the habitable zone of its parent star, where conditions are just right, not too hot, not too cold, for liquid water to exist. Imagine waterfalls, winding waterways, immense lakes, and possibly even seas as deep and mysterious as the Mariana Trench. 
Yet, before we dream of exploring Proxima b, we must consider its quirks. For instance, a single day on this fascinating exoplanet lasts a staggering 11 Earth days. Imagine dawns that stretch on for days, sunsets that linger, and brilliant twilight hours photographers could only dream of. While this sounds idyllic, it raises significant questions about its atmosphere and habitability. How might human biorhythms adapt to such extended light and dark cycles? Would we eat three or four times as much during a single day? Would we sleep differently? The very patterns of life as we know them would be both tantalizingly familiar and bewilderingly strange. It's as if nature has presented us with an enigma wrapped in a puzzle, challenging our understanding of what makes a planet habitable. You may wonder how we can gather accurate and reliable data about a world we've never visited. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its diverse capabilities, acts as a giant Swiss army knife in space. It's more than just a telescope. It's a comprehensive research laboratory in the vacuum of space. Thanks to its groundbreaking technology, cosmologists can not only observe planets but examine them through a prism of scientific instruments. That would make CSI labs look simple. Using advanced spectrographs, the Webb telescope can analyze the light emitted and reflected by these distant planets. Every element or compound in a planet's atmosphere absorbs or emits light at a specific frequency. By studying these patterns, scientists can perform a remote biopsy of celestial bodies, determining not only atmospheric pressure and density but also the possible presence of compounds essential for life, like water, organic carbon molecules, and even oxygen. This is space forensics, not just cosmology but space criminology. We don't sit idly, waiting for clues to come to us. We actively seek them, investigating the atoms and molecules that make up these complex worlds. The Webb Telescope isn't just an eye in the sky but a highly specialized research lab, investigator, and cosmic detective all in one. It allows us to turn our theories and speculations about alien worlds into strategies to confirm or deny them, revolutionizing our understanding of what might exist beyond our blood. Just when you thought you had uncovered the most shocking layers of this astronomical onion, the story takes an unexpected turn. Much like in any sci-fi thriller, scientists using the James Webb Space Telescope caught something remarkable from Proxima b, a signal so surprising that it spread throughout academic hallways and social media. Named as a potential technosignature, it was an electromagnetic emission so complex and intricately designed that it could point to the presence of an advanced civilization. The collective heartbeat of humanity seemed to stop at the peak of a discovery that promised to reshape our view of reality. Could the signal be the historical proof that we are not alone in the universe? And just as quickly as it appeared, the signal vanished without repeating itself, leaving behind not only an overwhelming silence but also a labyrinth of unanswered questions and bubbling theories. Was it simply a transient celestial anomaly, a coincidence of cosmic alignment, or something more intentional? A coded message or even a sign of extraterrestrial intelligence? The lone mission cast a shadow of mystery over Proxima b, igniting fierce discussion and speculation. Was it merely a passing oddity, or is it part of a much larger story, more complex than we can imagine? But wait, the story of our cosmic exploration isn't complete. The ink has not yet dried, and new chapters are still being written. This time, it's not just traditional researchers but Harvard scientists who are leading a shift in perspective in our search for extraterrestrial life. They are not content with merely investigating the signal and phenomena we've discussed so far, they are raising the stakes by turning the James Webb Space Telescope into a kind of giant night vision telescope. They aim to search for artificial light sources in both the dark and illuminated areas of distant worlds. We're talking about staggering possibilities, such as the chance of detecting Earth-like versions of cities glowing in the dark like bright spots. Imagine seeing the glowing beams of what could be a city humming with the presence of an advanced civilization, radiating its warmth into the vast cosmic seas. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of the universe, the journey for extraterrestrial life takes on new dimensions. Beyond the immediate interest in Proxima b, our grand search digs deeper into the immense, unfamiliar regions of space. 
This pursuit is driven by both technological advancements and a profound curiosity about our place in the universe. Ongoing breakthroughs in cosmology and space exploration have led to the discovery of numerous exoplanets with potential habitability. Instruments like the James Webb Space Telescope, biosignatures, and ground-based observatories have expanded our ability to identify and study these distant worlds. One particularly intriguing area of study is the search for biosignatures, indicators of life. These signs could include atmospheric gases like methane or carbon dioxide, which, under the right conditions, could suggest biological processes. The JWST's capabilities extend beyond simple detection. Its advanced instruments can measure the atmospheric composition of exoplanets with remarkable precision. By studying starlight that filters through an exoplanet's atmosphere, scientists can detect chemical markers indicative of life. For example, the presence of water vapor alongside other key molecules such as oxygen or ozone could point to the potential for life-sustaining conditions. Another avenue of investigation involves studying the environments of these distant worlds. Climate models based on data from the JWST can help predict whether an exoplanet's conditions could support liquid water. This is crucial because water is considered a fundamental element for life as we know it. Scientists are particularly interested in planets located in the habitable zone of their parent stars, where temperatures might allow stable liquid water. The search also extends to the moons of exoplanets. Some of these moons, especially those in the habitable zones of their host planets, might have conditions conducive to life. For example, icy moons in our own solar system, like Europa and Enceladus, are thought to harbor subsurface oceans beneath their icy crusts. Similarly, moons orbiting exoplanets could present analogous conditions where life might exist. Moreover, the concept of technosignatures has gained traction. These are signs of advanced civilizations that may be detectable through artificial structures or technologies. This could include megastructures like Dyson spheres, hypothetical constructs designed to capture a star's energy, or unusual patterns in radio transmissions. As we refine our global collaborations and observational techniques, the search for technosignatures could uncover the presence of extraterrestrial intelligence. In addition to technological advances, International cooperation plays a critical role in the search for extraterrestrial life. Collaborations between space agencies, research institutions, and private companies enhance our ability to explore space. For example, missions to Mars and other celestial bodies involve contributions from multiple nations, pooling resources and expertise to achieve common goals. Public engagement and education are also vital components of this mission. The excitement surrounding space exploration inspires the next generation of scientists and engineers. Efforts, programs, and educational initiatives help foster an interest in STEM fields and encourage young people to pursue careers in space science. The development of new technologies also contributes to our understanding of the universe. Advances in telescope design, data processing, and computational models improve our ability to detect and analyze distant exoplanets. For example, next-generation space telescopes like the planned Extremely Large Telescope, ELT, and the Habitable Exoplanet Observatory, HabX, are poised to offer even more detailed observations and deeper insights into the potential habitability of exoplanets.